know, of all the things we've studied in the learning and development marketplace, the one topic that comes up year after year after year is learning culture. You can develop great programs. You can have a beautiful video library. You can have a fantastic portal. You can have a great platform. People will only use it if they feel that it is rewarded in the company, if it is valued, if they are given time. In fact, one of the interesting studies that just recently came out is the biggest obstacle to learning today is people saying, I don't have enough time. And learning culture is all about management. Do leaders ask questions? Do they have after action reviews when things don't go well? Do they talk about mistakes? Do they give people the opportunity to improve themselves after they, uh, maybe they're in a job that they're not performing well? Um, do they reward people for development? Those are all cultural aspects. Do they help each other? Will someone mentor someone else? Those are all um, behaviors that are driven by the reward system in the company and the culture that comes down from the top. So I would remind you that no matter what you're doing in the learning and development profession, what you're buying, culture will always be one of the most important tools that you have to drive success.